We begin with breaking news. The hunt for a serial rapist responsible for attacking at least eight women has been arrested. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Sean Gables. Hi everybody, I'm Mike Dunstan. That man has been running from police for two years and tonight we have team coverage. We begin with CBS 46's Yasmina Alston live in Clayton County at the scene of the latest attack. Yasmina. Well, Mike, this is the man Clayton County police have been looking for for years. A serial rapist that had women all over Clayton County concerned for their safety, especially at night when many of these attacks would happen. Well, we know as of this afternoon, 24 year old Kenneth Thomas Bowen III has been arrested and he's been connected to at least eight of these cases. Now we've covered several of those cases, including the latest one, like you said, that we reported here on South Lake Parkway in Morrow at an apartment complex. We've shown you sketches of the serial rapist before, and now he is in police custody. Now, we did learn that during the investigation, police found out Bowen was once briefly employed with Clayton County Police as a police recruit, but he was terminated before finishing academy, so he was never a certified police officer with Clayton County. We know he was arrested at his job today and charged with rape. Again, this suspected Clayton County serial rapist has been captured, and this is the man connected to cases all over Clayton County, including Riverdale, Jonesboro, and Morrow, where we are right now. It's a story that we'll continue following tonight. Mike.